Welcome, Bonjour. welcome back to Watch It Rise on YouTube. It's Alexander speaking, your host, and with me is Christian Selmoni. Hello, Alexander. How are you this morning? Christian Selmoni is heritage and style. No, style and heritage. You can you can say it in two, the two ways. Um, style and heritage. No problem for me. Yes. Style and heritage, director of Washeron Constantin here in Geneva. Yes. And Christian uh, is the expert that will, together with me, show you an incredible timepiece in platinum. It's see. a perpetual calendar chronograph. Yes which is dressed in platinum with a beautiful salmon dial. Ah, crazy watch, fantastic. So, and always like it is on Watch Advisor, um, Christian and Alexander will disappear from your screens. The watches are the stars, not us. We are just talking, you will hear our voices and enjoy the video and you will see it in a close up on your screen. Bye. Goodbye. Don't forget to subscribe and to hit the bell to get our latest notifications. So we are uh, here with the traditional uh, perpetual calendar chronograph. And this year, we are introducing at Vachon Constantin, I would say a new signature. Uh, we could say also a kind of capsule collection within the collections. So let me uh, briefly explain to you, Alexander, what it is. We, um, this is the very first time piece to enter this uh, signature, which is about the combination of platinum and salmon dial. By signature, I mean that uh, in the years to come, we will find again uh, salmon dials uh, in other watches and other collections of Ashwa Constantin, maybe. It will be then always uh, platinum cases. And um, this will be not limited, but uh, of course available in a few uh, quantities. So we are starting this uh, new uh, capsule or new signature with this, uh, this amazing timepiece which is, uh, once again, the traditional uh, perpetual calendar chronograph. So, Alex, as you know very well, the combination uh, between um, uh, platinum and uh, sometimes as well uh, steel and salmon dial is something which comes from the 40s. And Vachon Constantin did, for example, um, great chronographs with this uh, color combination in the 40s. And then in the 90s, we came as well with the uh, platinum cases and salmon dial in the historic chronograph 4711 or the 1992 uh, perpetual chronograph reference 49005. And so we are back with this combination of uh, platinum and salmon dial. And our designers made their best efforts in order to create, uh, let's say, a dedicated uh, salmon color for this, uh, this uh, signature. All the hands, I would say, besides hours, minutes and seconds, will be in blued steel. Blued steel. So the central um, chronograph, yes. central hand, uh, second hand is blued steel. You have it on the 13 minute subdial. You have it on the indication of the date. And yeah, this is linked to the time because it's the running second. So you do have a differentiation in color. But yes. Bravo, well done. Thank so you, at Alexander. one glance, when you're using the chronograph, you know which, be which belongs this hand and this hand belong together. And you know, if you want to make a reading, you just orientate in terms of colors. Voila. You are absolutely right. <laughs> and then in addition, other codes for this, uh, this uh, signature, the, the bracelets, the straps will be of blue color, Spanish. matching with the hands. And there is a kind of secret signature for this uh, capsule collection, Alex. And this is about the Maltese Cross logo at Wait. 12 o'clock. Tell me, Alex, if you don't mind, what do you think, what do you see? It looks, uh, you know, when you first time look on it, it looks if it is not completely fully oriented up, upside down. But obviously it seems that it has been, has a matte and a polished surface. Uh, exactly. Is this it, what you wanted to hear? Yes, very much. Congratulations, <laughs> Alexander. So, oh, uh, yeah. so this is a kind of three-dimensional Matisse cross. And this is the secret signature of this new uh, platinum solbondan combination. There is a polished and a matte surface, and it's really three-dimensional. I'm trying to play around. Now you see it. Very much. You see here that there is one part of the Maltese cross looking black, and the other one, yeah, reflecting this uh, part where it is black is uh, the polished one, and the other one is the matte one. Very nice. I s we got it. Thank you, Alexander. Wonderful. So um, the last thing I would like to show you is that uh, if you look at the, the moon phase disc, it is also made of platinum and it has been engraved with faces which are not the same. So we have one 
face which is smiling and the other uh, face on the disc will be melancholic. And so, as you know, Alexander, I'm sure this is a kind of a wink um, when compared with some table clocks of the 19th century. Also, um, if you were an expert and you see the watch, what kind of movement it is in terms of semi-oscillations, you can already discover it. When you see it on the graduation here in between the seconds, there are two dots. You see here two dots. And what happens, the center second hand swipes over the dial in the speed of one-sixth of a second. And when you count in between, on, in between, on, you come to one, two, three, four, five, six. And it's one-sixth of a second. So very well done, correctly done. These graduations very often are not done correctly. So they are keeping those four dots in between the, sen uh, the second dots the graduation and this is uh, you have from the old one fifth of a second chronographs but if you have a different uh, frequency in the movement you should also have a correct graduation and here's well done then what you don't see or what is also visible here there is a tachymeter scale scale here yeah. tachymeter scale on the Reuho. this is correct yeah here graduation you see here there's base 1000 use it as a tachymeter. Did I say anything wrong, Christian? No, no, no. <laughs> it's, it's a pleasure to be with you, Alexander, because you are, you are such an expert. So thank I'm, you very much for, for doing the job um, better than I could do. No, 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 no. no. I'm, I'm just, I'm very keen in these details. Um, uh, Christian, tell me a little bit about the, the movement. Yes, <clears throat> with pleasure. So inside this timepiece is beating uh, the caliber 1142. Uh, and uh, this is a legendary movement, uh, which, uh, which was initially uh, created in 1942. And this is the latest version of the 1142 uh, with, uh, I would say, a higher frequency, as you mentioned, Alexander, and of course, uh, Geneva Seal. So uh, we have added on this movement a perpetual calendar module. And uh, while it's, uh, you know, this kind of uh, combination of two complications is something which is very close from, from our heart at Vachon Constantin, and it's great to have this beautiful timepiece here at Watches and Wonders 2022. Here is the column wheel. Here, here's the column wheel. I just wanted to stop it, activate the chronograph and show you. You see here? Yep. Either the nose falls into the holes or not. The chronograph is started or stopped. It's a little bit difficult to show with the light. Here is the column wheel. It's some reflections, but you see here? And there's a little nose picking up the information from the column wheel and then either the uh, central wheel is connected to the movement, the chronograph central wheel is connected to the chronograph or not. And there you go. Voila. A little detail. Maybe from this side. Yeah. Nice reflections here. You see? And then you see here, this wheel connects the chronograph central wheel. And then the chronograph starts and stops. Voila. Beautiful movement. Perpetual calendar. Of course, there are some correctors you need to do the adjustments on the case. The case, uh, did we mention the, the diameter of the case? I don't think so, Christian. So the diameter is 43 millimeter. Mm -hmm. And the total thickness, because I'm sure you are, you are going to ask me the question, Alexander, it's a 12.94 millimeter. Uh, the case is water protected, I would say, not waterproof, up to 30 meters. Is this? It is right. Yeah. So, <coughs> basic. Yeah, but it's not a watch you're going to swim with anyhow. But it is. Well, I hope so. Now, please. Gosh. Ooh. Ooh. All the engravings. This is not going to be a limited production. It's going to be a limited production, but it's not going to be a limited edition. Edition. Limited production due to the fact that uh, you are um, limited in the capac capacity to manufacture more pieces than you do anyhow. Just a quick uh, run through on the dial. Leap year indication here. It's Sunday, April. Um, it is the 3rd April, correct date. Moon phase is set correctly. This is the um, running second. This is the 30 minute counter belonging to the chronograph. Yep. And here's that famous 
three-dimensional Maltese cross. And uh, yeah, just in case you are thinking now that I'm an idiot and scratching the watch, no, it won't happen. This is my famous Bergeron um, plastic pointer that comes into your screen. And if you think you have to verify this, please go to the Bergeron website and then you will see that this is plastic. And Christian, I think you will confirm this is something you often use to show details on watches. Absolutely. So I yeah, just I wanted to mention this because sometimes people say, hey, the guy is scratching the watches. He's, no, I can't. This will not scratch it. <laughs> okay, the folding clasp. Opening so up. there is a security, Alex, yeah. so you, you have to push on both pieces. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Thank you, Christian. Both, you push, and then it opens up. There you go. And you have the famous clasp with the half, half Maltese cross. Passion Constantin, like, price-wise, Christian, what do one has to pay for? So in Marvel? Swiss francs, including taxes, is 153,000. 153,000. Swiss francs, including 7.7% .7 of VAT, the price. So, thanks very much for watching um, this little presentation about a absolute gorgeous watch. Christian, thank you very much for joining me. Thank you, Alexander. As always, it's a great pleasure for me. And yeah, comments are welcome, questions are welcome. If I can't answer them, I'll pass them to Christian and you will get the answer back. But yeah, thanks for watching. Stay tuned on Watch Advice on YouTube. And please do discover all the other videos we are taping here on Watches and Wonders 2022. And of course, the other videos we just taped with Vacheron Constantin. Bye, bye guys.